everyone. Welcome to Fame World Educational Hub. Myself, Ashwarya Saxena. And uh, today in the series of Python, I'm just going to start a new program. I have taken a new file from the idle, uh, the shell, you can see. This was the shell and I have taken a new file. So basically, in the further videos, we will start with PyCharm. But today, uh, like in this video also, I'm just going to tell with idle only. So you will get a good grip on idle also. Like if you are not having any ID in your system, then you can just work on idle. So I'm just going to create a new program. And the program question I'm writing in the comment section. Uh, sorry, in the comments. So write a program to a character and check um, put a character and check if it is. Vowel or consonant. So basically, when we are working on this program, we will understand the concept of if else using character and also the logical operator. If logical operator and or not are there, so we will be using and logical and here. So let's start. Suppose I'm taking ch as a variable and I'm taking input. Here a character. And here basically I am just taking this zero so what will happen like only a single character will be taken as input if I am going to take check for the vowel so for vowel a e i o u there are five vowels so we can do just if a uh, ch equal equal to a and or not this way we have to write and or not okay so or ch equal equal to a e or ch equal equal to i or ch equal equal to o or ch equal equal to u so a e i o u we have taken print ch is a vowel else print ch is consonant so this way let's uh, save it and run it so i'm just going to save it uh, here we are saving it we will just save it We will just run it with this run module or F5 the shortcut key. You can just see that it's asking to enter a character. Okay, suppose I've taken A, so it's saying A is a vowel. Okay, so this way, okay, I just let's open the file again. I just want to make some changes and show you that uh, when you are working on this program, one more thing is necessary to be taken. Like this, you can see that it is. Uh, all the small alphabets you have taken we should also take the capital alphabets here because if the person will enter capital A it will say that it is a consonant like let me just run and tell you so here you can see if I am taking capital A it is saying A is consonant, uh, consonant. basically it is not a consonant it is a vowel only so in that condition what we should do we should just give ch equal equal to capital A or ch equal equal to capital E or ch equal equal to capital O or ch equal equal to U so capital U A E I I have not taken A E I O ch equal or ch equal equal to U so this way basically it's necessary to take it in this way okay just run the module okay you can see that there is error basically i have just taken this enter just to show you uh, the, uh, the program so we have to take it at the same line otherwise the alignment should be not indentation to be changed 
So suppose I'm taking capital E, so it will say that E is a vowel. Then also it is coming correct now. So this way we have to consider it. In this video, I am stopping till here only, and in the next video we will see some more program. See you in the next lecture. Stay tuned.